It's Manby back with yet another video, and today we are returning the famous Tyranitar. We're, we're, we're bringing it back. Um, yeah, so this is a cool team that I found by Anui. Um, obviously the rental code's right here, so I won't put it in the description. Um, but yeah, this is a cool team. I want to try Tyranitar. It's got some cool stuff I think that can help it. Um, you know, be a little bit better in Series 12. Focus Ash 1 to keep it alive because it will die to one shot from Azation or anything. Um, but yeah, Foul Plague, really cool. Assurance, really cool. Stone Edge, really cool. Thunder Wave, super cool. But yeah, this is the team that we got. We're going to get some games with it. I actually really like Dialga with Power Gem as uh, a lot of the, the instants are Shuckaberry right now. So I think 4 attack Dialga definitely has its place. We definitely got some cool stuff too, like the Leer, Tornadus. Rocky Helmet's a, a, a choice, but anyway, yeah. We're going to go ahead and get some games, so I'll see you guys when we find our first match. Okie smokey, we have found an opponent here against Apple. Uh, rank 399, we're in the 700s. They got Shedinja and Sableye. That should be illegal. You should not be allowed to have both. You should only have one stupidly gimmicky Pokemon at a time. Anyway... Um, very interesting team. I almost want to guarantee you that ooh, speed swap. Ooh, ooh. Um, no body press. I mean, we have body press. No iron defense. Um, how do we want to do this? I feel like Torn is good, but I don't know. You know, I feel like Rillaboom is also really, really good with fake out and all that kind of stuff. Um, the only thing is, how do I deal with one Sableye? I feel like we just go with this thing and like Rillaboom. If they have Sableye, we kind of just ignore it. If they have Shedinja, we just cry. Actually, we got Rock. Rocks. Rock. Rocket. Um, okay. Um, uh, ooh, ooh! Tyranitar is actually really nice in the back. Um, we don't want Trick Room up at all. We should go with something like... We should just go with the Pressure. Um, let's go with Rilla. Zacian Tyranitar. We have no good switch-ins, but... This is Series 12! Do you need a good switch-in? No, you just need a... Overwhelm your opponent with stupid things like Dynamax Dialga that one-shots every Pokemon in the entire game. That's what you need to do. Alright, their team is giga interesting though. They have like... I don't know. I don't even know what to say about their team. But if I can kill something as ugly as... Uh, this is where Max Rock Balls could be really nice. I don't know. In Tyranitar? Ooh. And if they're Focus Sash, they just lose the Sash. So yeah, this is, this is interesting. Tyranitar, nice. It's nice to have if you're playing against a Shedinja, I'll tell you that. We'll see if we can get some dubs. Alright. Oh, God. Okay, they leave these two. So I'm honestly horrified to try to attack the, um, the Lecky because I feel like, um, I feel personally like they may, um, they may switch. They may, they may do a switchy do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click max. Dragon. See, I what if I went for Max Rock? This might be really bad. Max Rock? And hope it kills. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I don't need Max Rock. Let's just go for Max Dragon. The strongest one. Max Dragon. Into you. Kill you. And then we'll go Tyranitar, because that gets up the Sandstorm, and it'll break its uh, the Sableye Sash anyway. Okay, so they hard swap that. This is going to be a Shedinja. This is going to be a Shedinja. Weird. It's a Shedinja. I feel like I thought that attacking um, Reggie Lucky would be a bad idea because of a possible Sedinja threat. So that's very interesting that they switch in Sedinja into that threat. Um, yeah, now we got go for the Dynamax. Now Sableye can't really do a whole lot to us other than go for something like a will o -Wisp on my right side. Um, but Tyranitar, if you didn't know, is a Dark type, and Dark type are immune to the the threats of a prankster Pokemon like. A Sableye. So, if we go for this Max Dragon right here, not only do we break the potential Sash of the Sableye... Ah, oh, they they do the other gimmick. They trick me. Um, we have an Eject button now, so we're gonna get... <laughs> we're gonna get, um, Shadow Snuck, probably. But the good thing is, that means we can probably go for this, um... This Shedinja here yonder. Um, so Sableye for a Dynamax. Will that have been worth it? Probably not, but it's okay. Um, so the Focus Sash... The Focus Sash has got to be on... Well, it's not on... It's Safety Goggles. 
It's a uh, safe. It's safety goggles. Um, Shedinja. All right. So now we are gonna lose our Dynamax. The question is, do we just take it? My, my assumption is yes. Now I got assurance to be able to hit the Shedinja. I think I'm gonna actually go for it only because I know they're safety goggles and they're going to click. I think they're going to click Shadow Sneak here. Now, if they're really good at the game, they Shadow Sneak the Tyranitar. That would be a crazy play. I think I just... You know what? It's just scary. We have to go into Rillaboom. First of all, we want the eject button, so we want to get Shadow Snack. So let's see how this goes. We're going to Quake. What if I Rock Ball? <laughs> uh, oh, no. No way, Sharon. So sure. Here we go. Okay. Let's hope this works. Shadow Sneak me, please. They went for the Tyranitar. Okay, so we have to hope we're faster. It's 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 a sad day. It's a sad day. Okay, at least Dialga tanks. Yeah, that's that's what bad looks like. All right. They hit the right Pokemon. God. Uh, I couldn't click Dynamax. And then there's safety goggles. The one safety goggles Shedinja that has ever been existing ever. Um. Okay. Cool thing is, I can still go into Dialga, I think. I don't want to go for something like Imprisoned, but I'm not going to. I'm going to click Protect, most likely. Okay. There is that. Uh, now, I could go into something like a Rillaboom. I'm going to go into the boy here. Uh, but we'll see how this goes. We'll see how this goes. I don't know how this is going to go, but we're going to try to kill that thing. Check. And we are going to go for the gem. They're not going to expect a power gem here. They're going to expect the Shedinja should be free, so... Yeah, we'll see what it goes for. Um, yeah, I think the worst case scenario would be... If they went for... Um, ally switch. That would be the worst case scenario, but if I hit the... Pulp, the, the what's it called? It might not be a bad thing. Uh, so that's good. But we'll see. Uh, because it might be Scarf, because if you see a team this gimmicky, they might just have the Choice Scarf anyway. But um, they do Dynamax, so throw everything I thought about the, the uh, Scarf away, because that is no longer an issue. I'm just really, really trying to kill the Shedinja. Because I don't want it to live. I don't want it to breathe air. God, Shedinja is just a bad Pokemon. What a, a stupid idea. Um... What if it didn't have Alex, which maybe would be slightly less annoying, but still annoying. Alright, it went for Endure. Fantastic. Okay, so it does, I guess, guess that we have Max Rock Ball, I guess. Because it clicked Endure against two Pokemon that normally don't have anything that can actually hit it. So we got that going for us. Uh, Rillaboom can kill it. So that's good. Um, I just love how they read... Too. They read the fact that I didn't attack. Anyway, now we have the hard switch into our Rillaboom now, which sucks. That's what we have to do. Um, and go for another power jump. Um, can't really do too much here. Can't do much at all. Because they're now they're going to guys are the... The Zation. They know what they're doing. They can't Poltergeist. Um, my Dialga, which is nice at the very least. But we'll see what they do. There goes Rillaboom. I'm gonna lose the grassy terrain here in a second. It's the only thing that sucks. Now they go for the out. See, it's just it's just how does anyone have fun? Like I like there is zero amount of fun for my side. They go for they still Okay, alright, okay. I honestly if I just get Shedinja, I'm just not gonna record the video. I'm just gonna play the game and you guys won't see it. Because it's just not fun. It takes no absolutely zero percent skill to play that Pokemon too. Nobody wins. Nobody wins. Alright, so the game's over. Not by skill. You trick a jack button me and then gimmicked me with, with, with Shedinja. There was, there was no skill to be had in this game. It's, it's just very unfortunate because when Dynamax is no longer a mechanic, you're just going to be very bad at Pokemon and it's going to be very sad. It's going to be very sad, you know? I feel bad. I feel bad for you. Alright, I'll see you guys once we find but another match with hopefully not Shedinja. Alright, we found an opponent rank 2051. This one's got this team. Looks like it's missing a Blastoise and a Reggie Lucky, but here we are. Alright, how do we want to do this? Now, Tyranitar seems quite good. Um, quite good. 
I actually kind of like the idea of Tyranitar here. Focus Ash is nice. Um, yeah. Dialga, could Dialga be good? Honestly, Dialga seems really good, too. I actually really like Dialga. Now, the only thing is, if they leave Thunderous plus Calyrex, can we deal with that? I think we can. I think we can. Now, Max Knuckle would be really annoying if they clicked it. What if they didn't have such a move? Um, what can you do? Can you do anything relevant for us? Taunt and Icy Wind and Tailwind. Honestly, what if I click Tailwind? Can I do anything at all? We're gonna try this more offensive kind of style here. Tyranitar in the back again. Tyranitar will get the shine at some point, that's for sure. Alright, maybe Tailwind's really good against this particular team. Um, yeah, so if they lead Thunderous and Calyrex will be fine. So we'll just click Tailwind. And it'll be good. And I can go for Max Rockfall. I actually think Max Rockfall Dialga is kind of good. Because it can break Sashes, which is really, really nice. Like on Calyrex. I actually go with Vation, which is somewhat annoying, but I actually just get to click a tail and an attack. So they're actually the one under fire here, which is really, really good. Um, so I'll take that. Question is, can I do enough damage to them? The thing is, I, I feel like I can go for a Quake pretty dang easily over here. Onto the Zation. The only thing is Zation's always protect or do something. So I'd love to click Roar of Time, but I don't think it's the right play. <laughs> just to boost him up. But I think I'm going to go for a Steel Spike. Boost my defense here and go for a Tailwind. I can also go for Leer. <laughs> but that's not going to help me this particular turn. We'll go for a Tailwind this first turn. Um, yeah. I don't know. And then maybe an Icy Wind Max Dragon? We'll see how much Steel Spike does. And if I think Roar of Time Icy Wind can kill it, they still brainlessly die to Max the Thunderous. I guess if you're leading it, you're going, ow. Alright, so if they click Protect here, we'll have gotten them, which would be nice. Um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I can always go for an Icy Wind next turn, which is really, really nice. Um, the only thing is, Thunderous is annoying. But we're going to find out real quick what item this Thunderous has and if we can beat it. The thing is, if it's AB, I can just kind of ignore it for the rest of my life. Um, if it's Life Orb, I can kill it. Which is good, but we'll see. Alright. Now let's see if they click the Zation Special to protect on turn one. They did an amazing. So I could have just clicked Tail One and Quaked and I would have died. And there was almost no drawback about going for that, but here we are, going for a Steel Spike, which won't help me against the Sacred Sword. But Steel Spike does a whole lot of damage, so I feel like Icy Wind Max Dragon will actually kill. If not, I've kind of put myself in a position that I have to risk it in some way. Shaver Worm, we'll see what happens this turn. Um, they go for Max Knuckle. They're also faster than the Zation, so that's about the cringiest thing that could actually ever happen. But here we are. Especially when you consider how bad their turn actually was by clicking not to protect or switch with Zation. So I should live this. Yeah. Alright, so they got literally no speed, so we got that going for us. Um, now, can I beat... which one's harder to beat? Zation? See, Zation's... I've got Imprisoned Zation, so I think we just go for... Um, we just go for the KO here. I'm gonna go for Max Dragon and an Icy Wind. Now, this is really bad if we don't get the KO, but we go for it. We go for it. Yeah, I think we go for it. Even if they kill my Dialga, I don't think it's the end of the world. They actually do protect now. For turn two protect, but not turn one. So, yeah. Yeah, alright, let's see. Icy Wind obviously doesn't hit the protect. Let's see how much Icy Wind does here. 50%. Oh my god, it did no kinds of nothing. Alright. Now we gave him plus 50, so that's good. Just defiant. Alright, Max Dragon, can we get the KO? This is gonna do a lot more than Steel Spike did, I'll tell you that. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. Alright. We're still okay. They do get Defiant and probably get to kill which, whichever one they want to kill, but it's okay. Um, who are they going for? They're going for a Knuckle. Alright. Let's not go for a Leer, Behemoth Blade. That is a thing. The only thing is I probably am prison. Imprisoned like Icy Wind, I think. 
I think that's the best play, because then they can't actually use position, which is really nice. So I think that's fine. I just have to hope Icy Wind kills the stupid thing, but I think it will. Okay, so let's go into the Zation. I think we're okay. The uh, Thundee is probably plus 50 by now. Okay, let's do this. Got the Intrepid. Now we click and Charizion. Just for science sake, I want to see how much this has. Plus 5. XD. Alright, we'll go for Icy Wind as it's our literally only attacking move. Uh, but that's fine. Click Icy Wind, we'll be happy. They will no longer be able to click Protect when Zacian is out and about. Okay, we imprison. Sorry, Zacian. And Icy Wind. We connect. We kill the Thunderous. We slow down the Zacian. Sorry, buddy. So that's good. They can click Play Rough. <clears throat> the good thing is it doesn't do anything against um, Zacian. Oh, it does, but it doesn't do it as much. So yeah, we got that going for us. Oh, you can't use Behemoth Blade? Now they're minus one and they're imprisoned. So we can really just kind of bully whatever partner Pokemon comes in here. Um, so that's really good for us. Let's see what it is. It actually is Incense. That's not good, but it's not terrible. So they could go for something like a Protect. It's really not that big of a deal. So we just we just go for we just go for the dude. I could also switch in something like a see I can't leer. So I kind of I think I just go into Tyranitar. How many times I trick him or not? Doesn't really matter. Okay, one. All right, we go for Sacred Sword here. And we will hard switch into one Tyranitar. I think we'll be okay. If they fake out, it's not really a big deal. Yeah, it's not really a big deal if they fake out, I think. They can't click Sacred Sword, so my Tyranitar is kind of protected. They can click Play Rough, which is annoying. Which will still probably one-shot my Tyranitar, because... Yeah. But maybe they don't have Play Rough. We'll see. Um, yeah, we've been Intimidated, so that's annoying. Flare Blitz shouldn't kill us, which is fine. Okay, we switch into Tyranitar. We get to see if it can do something now. Get him, T-Tar. T-Tar should be good at killing Incense. That should never have changed. Okay, and they go for Quick Attack, which sucks because they broke my Sash, but here we are. Uh, they didn't go for... They didn't go for a Dance. They are Berry. Wow. Um, okay, they got a lot of health back. Do they Flare Blitz me? They do. So I lose a million health, probably. Almost all. God, is Quick Attack going to kill me? Yeah, this sucks, because they can actually kill me with quick attacks. And I have literally no Pokemon that can attack it. Oh my god. Alright, I'm going to Behemoth Blade, and hopefully like crit it, or like get it enough damage that we can kill it. Stone Edge, try to kill you. I think we still probably lose this one. I lost my Sash over on Tyranitar. Tyranitar losing its Sash is kind of a big deal. Because they probably have Calyrex Shadow Rider in this match. But we'll see. They also have to rely on 80% accurate Stone Edge. My favorite move ever. And then I don't think we can still kill the Zacian. But we'll see. Or maybe Tailwind plus something. A quick Attack again. I think Zacian should live. Doesn't. Oh god. Alright. Pokemon is a very fun game. Alright, we do connect on Stone Edge, but now we literally have zero things that can kill a Zacian. My Zacian with Imprison lost a Zacian, which is probably why you don't run Imprison, because it's not a very good ability to run on Zacian. Here we are. You can see Calyrex, but there's just nothing we can do against it. And now the Zacian isn't Imprisoned, so the game is over. And there's Calyrex Shadow Rider, which would have been good if there was no Zacian. But, yeah, here we are. Alright, now we run. Okay. Tyranitar at least got a kill. Good job, Tyranitar, you did it. You did it, buddy. Maybe next game we can get something better for us. And of course, my opponent has to take 66 seconds on a turn that literally takes no brain. You just click attack, and then you click attack with the two strongest Pokemon in the game. But! I gotta take 90 seconds to uh, for watch to watch them forfeit. So yeah, still still waiting, still awaiting. 
not like this play takes any sort of brain. Okay. So, yeah, I will see you guys when we find another game. Okay, trainer has been found. Um, they got Palkia Calyrex Ice, which is cool. Um, what can we do against that? So we have safety goggles on this, which is nice. I feel like Dialga is kind of nice. What do I want Dialgaization? Just kind of put some pressure on it and then I can go Bronzong if I need to. Um, do like a... Well, I don't know about speed spot, but... Yeah, actually, I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know if Tyranitar is even any good here. Um, don't know if it's that great, but we'll go with it, because it's got Foul Play, which is actually a good move. And I don't know if Rillaboom's even good here either, but we'll see how this goes for us. But we'll see what they got. Alright. Let's see. What you got for me? They got the... Pocky Lando. Oh no, they copied the Manby lead. Alright, we gotta pay attention to the Scarf Lando here. Either way, we're in trouble. And it's Scarf Lando. Yeah, we're in, we're in huge trouble here. I have two ground weak Pokemon. Alright, but they do have to worry about the Zacian more than the Dialga. So what I think I can do is actually just go for a Max Dragon anyway. We have to switch you into something. Now they're gonna go for... We have Levitate? We have Levitate. Okay, um, this is good. The only thing is there might be... Yeah, well, they could be quaking it. I'm gonna go into... I'm gonna go into... It's literally my only possible switching. So we're gonna try to go into that. Even if we kill the Palkia, the Dialga... Or the Lando is still kind of a problem, but we do have... Um... Yeah, we still have ways to beat it. Okay. Go into the Zong. Don't want Zacian to die here. They do Dynamax. Um, they're also faster than us, so even if they did click Bulldoze, which they might, they would be faster than us. But if they do click Bulldoze, maybe I can click Trick Room, which is good. But yeah, I'm hoping that Dialga can live here. It should be able to live. Unless they went for like Earthquake, Max Quake. That would suck. But we'll see. Got the Cherish Ball. Scarf Lando is, I think, the best version of Lando. Also, people don't pay attention, so you can get away with running Scarf. Cause, yeah, I was smart enough, having used Scarf Lando, to know it's faster. it was faster than Zacian, so I know it's Scarf. Um, yeah, so we got that information. They do go for the Bulldoze, so I do get the, uh, the Levitate, which is nice. Um, yeah, now I can go for a Trick Room, which is actually really nice as well. Um, oh my god, Bulldoze just did 60% of my health. Of course, they crit me. Ow. Oh my god. Alright, and they go for my quick too. Okay. I just don't want to play Pokemon. I just really don't want to play Pokemon today. I just don't know how that ever kills me, other than the fact that they got the freaking Bulldoze crit. But the fact that they go for that read and just ignore the Zacian that would play Repid for 95% of its health is ridiculous. But here we are. Now I want to click Ally Switch. But there's probably no point. Alright, we got Tyranitar on the back. Um, not exactly sure what to click here. No matter what, it's bad. But I'll click Protect Trick Room and see what we can do. Um, ooh, I got Hypnosis. Oh, we don't have trigger. Thanks. Okay, well, we got that going for us. Um, guess we'll click the hypnosis. Uh, see what we can do with that. They might just click like Max Geyser or something stupid. Honestly, it's just forfeit, but yeah. All right, gold those again. They scarf. It's either that or nothing. We'll see what they go for. I bet you they hard read and go for the. Yeah. Max Dragon. Yes. Why, why not be 5% into uh, into my Pokemon? Why not? All right.
right. Can we hit the hypnosis? Can we hit? Yes, we can. All right. I think we still lose 100 out of 100 times, but we'll try our best. They don't get another Dynamax turn. I don't. I didn't get one Dynamax turn, but we'll go for Sacred Sword here. I would love to go for Body Press. I'm going to Speed Swap. I don't know. Your point is speed spot? We'll try it. See if I can get my Zation faster. I actually hard swap it. Well, whatever's coming in is getting speed spot. Going slow. Alright, Amoongus is now slightly faster. Okay, we're already minus two. No, minus one. This should still be more than half. Yeah. Okay. Get that speed swap. I really wish I could trick room. But I can't. Um, we're safety goggles, we might as well stay in. Thing is, they're going to. They're just going to click anything but. Uh, I just don't know what to click. Uh, hopefully. Oh, a body press, I guess. They're going to click protect if they know what they're doing. And then they'll switch into Lando the next turn. Uh, we'll see though. We will see. Killing the Palkia will be really hard. Tyranitar is just not going to help a whole lot. We hard swap it instead of protecting, so that's good. Back into the Lando, which I expected at some point. Um, yeah, still in, still in some doo doo here, but we'll see if we can get out of it. Hemus Blade should still do a lot at minus two. Okay. Yeah, that's still good damage. Okay. Another sleep turn over there. Body press. Some damage, please. It's not terrible. Okay, now let's switch this guy out. I mean, I could protect, but... Alright, we'll go Hypnosis here. Yeah, we'll go protect Hypnosis. And then we can ally switch if the uh, Palkia wakes up, or if it doesn't. Okay. The U turn is good because I clicked Hypnosis. U turn does about 50. That's epic. We have a chance to put something to sleep at least. This is where I really wish I had play rest. Alright, so they go, they're just going to keep switching these guys in. Okay, we actually hit the Hypnosis, which is kind of nice. I actually think I'm going to Sacred Sword the, uh... Sacred Sword the... The guy. So we can try to kill it. And we're going to click Ally Switch here. Uh, yeah, I don't know why I'm wasting my time with this game that's over after turn one. I really thought I could live a bulldoze my sweet. I literally didn't get close to living. Okay, card swap for the 15th time. This is where I just hope I get crits if they're just going to keep spamming this garbage. Ow. Okay. Let's see it. Can I switch so we dodge the earth power? That's probably going to come from the Pogia. Sacred Sword crit. That's not a crit. Wakes up. Goes for Hydro Pump. Well done. You clicked Max Dragon, but you could have clicked something else. Of course, Hydro Pump does about 99. Okay, well, Body Press doesn't really matter because they're going to kill us anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, alright, we're going to for it. Oh, buddy. I, just, I can't believe I'm just getting destroyed so badly. Uh. Alright, I'll see you guys when we find another game. Okay, Trainer has been found. Moods. I feel you on that one. Rank 8 trillion. They got a Duraludon, so they've made it personal. Alright, so they've got Gimmicky Tailwind 2, which will be better than me if they have Taunt. So there's that. Uh, they also got the Immaculate Regilecki combination with Calyrex. 
So we got that going for us. Um, they also have... Oof. They also have the Bulldoze Boy. This is just tough. No matter what I do, it's tough. Like, I don't have... I don't know if I can actually kill Sogaleo in any way, shape, or form. Like, like, like actually. I think... Oh my god. I feel like I lose 100 out of 100 times in this matchup. Like, I actually... What Pokemon on this team does anything against Sogaleo? Both my Restricteds lose to Sogaleo. My support Pokemon all die, except for this one, which doesn't do anything good. I guess I'm gonna spam Hypnosis. I'm gonna go Tyranitar. Yeah, this is, this is just what it's gonna have to be. Alright, um, Dynamax. It's gonna have to be one of you fools. Crap. And by that I mean Dialga. Alright, well. Well, well, well. We'll see how this goes. See how this one is a going. Yeah, I, I think I lose 100 out of 100 times. I think they could lead 53 different combinations and beat everything that I can do. But we'll see. We will see what they do. I don't think I can beat a lot of their leads now. We'll see. Maybe I get lucky and we have something that I can handle. Women's got Calyrex. I'll take it. It's actually good for us. Um, the only thing is I don't really have a switch in for bronze on, but if they want to give up their, if they want to give up their guy, then I'll take it. You know, I'll take it. Yeah. All right. I don't know what bronze on wants to do, so I'm going to click assurance here. Assurance. See. If this thing had a good move, I think it'd be way better. But we're gonna go for a speed swap over here on whims in case we survive. <laughs> yeah, see, well, they switched that up, so that's good. See, they go in the Sogaleo though. Isn't gonna help us. They actually go for taunt. So I can't click speed swap. Very sad. Poor alley switch. But now I get to go for a fat assurance though. That's just really good damage. Um, alright, so as long as they don't double me, we're good here. Queen's buffeted. Alright, now I'm gonna go for foul play, in case they steal spike, but I'm really hoping we don't get hit with a... I'm really hoping we don't get hit with a Moonblast first. Um, cause, god, we got Shadow Snuck that last time, everyone, like, the stash has been a non-factor. So far. Soul took half his health though, so that's good. Okay, the Dynamax, please don't double me. I beg of you. Just click Tailwind once you have to be greedy and click Tailwind for once. Be the greed. Be the greed you want to see in the world. And click Tailwind, because you're like, oh, Tailwind? It makes me go faster. Tailwind, Tailwind, Tailwind. Oh my god, I, I just don't want to play Pokemon. Why do people, why? What if I was faster? But no, they gotta have they gotta have Taunt Whimsicott. God, the game's over. There will be no point to play. There will be no point to play the rest of this game because it's a plus fifteen Soul Galeo. So we got that going for us. All right, get him body press. Big damage. Alright, now you know this Whimsicott's probably got a eject button, but let's go ahead and get the eject buttoned again. <sighs> I should have hard swapped into Zacian that last turn because they would have been forced to go for a Tailwind. And then I wouldn't have been the loser of this game. But that would have been a hard play to go for. Anyway, we're gonna Quake and hope we live a Quake, which we probably won't, but that's okay. Um, we're gonna body press this, which is one turn too late because we're gonna get a eject button. Yeah, all right. Let's see it. Even if we don't get a jack button, we probably just die. So we got that. <laughs> oh my god! I can't even remember the last time I saw Silvio. Okay, they moonblast me. Guaranteed drop. 
I, I, I've played this game before. I don't know if you guys have played Pokemon before, but it's just I just know how the games are going to go. We live, but now they're plus 50, so they're probably not even going to die to this next quake. But we'll see. So I got the drop, the guaranteed drop. It's going to live by... Uh, hmm, I wonder, if they didn't get dropped there, do you think they would have died? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Possibly. Alright. Body press. Check button. It's not. What item it what what item do you have if it's not a check button? Or what? I guess I go for Alex switch here. And then try to win the game like that. Um Yeah. Cause if they go for Max Quake and Taunt <laughs> Then we'll be okay. We'll see what they go for. Taunt? Okay. Which I have four attacks anyway. There we go, okay. Now Calyrex just comes in and kills all of us, but that's okay. Maybe with plus two we won't die. And I can get a speed swap off on it. The only thing is if I get taunted, I can't click speed swap. <sighs> Okay, we should be able to live in Astro Barrage. I'm gonna hope we can live one. Play Galaxy Switch one more time. Never mind, we have 27 health. We just can't do anything. Why? Because our gimmicky bronze on just gets taunted and it's useless. I would add Gyro Ball or something useful. That would be nice. Alright. 27 health, there is just no way we live, right? I just don't think we live. I just don't think it's mathematically possible. How many turns of Sandstorm are there? Z. Oh, okay. Let's hit the run button. We tried, though. We, we stumbled on them one turn. That's good enough. That's good enough, you know? Oh, God, that was the worst video of all time. All right. Tyranitar, it did its best. It got literally... Everyone knew it was going to be Focus Ash the entire time, and we lost, made me lose two games, basically. It, it single-handedly could have carried us two games if people forgot that it could have Focus Ash, but apparently everyone knows it's Focus Ash. So, there's that. Anyway, we're out. We'll be back with, hopefully, another team that doesn't have Tyranitar in it, and, or mainly Bronzong. Um, <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys for watching, and yeah, we'll be back.